Samba was first to turn up tonight, but I've now sped it up a little bit so that it's not boring for like four or five minutes that he was here eating the food. It is cat food that he's actually eating as I put it out, knowing that the cats would possibly turn up first. And then a little while later, Ninja Cat turns up and again, he's eating the cat food that I've put out. And again, I've sped it up because it got boring. It's, he was here for about four or five minutes. Right, Kenny is already out and you can see him um, coming across the road back towards the house. Norman is outside at this stage as well. Pip then turns up, jumps up on the wall as he normally does. And even though you can't see him, he is still there. You can just see him in the corner of the picture, or the edge of the picture, I should say. He then disappears through the gap in the wall to return a few, well a minute later I think it was. And off he goes, but he's soon back again. Kenny then casually walks by.
Kenny sits by that car for ages, so I have sped this up as well. Whilst he's sitting there, Pip then runs past. Kenny sat there for ages, and then Norman casually walks past as if he's going to come in. Kenny then moves under the car as the van from up the road is coming home. Norman then runs past from right to left. I then go outside to call both the cats in and Norman is first. Don't blink but the black blob is Norman running past. Kenny at this stage, I've called him but I can't see him. He then casually walks down the right hand side of the car and comes back into the garden with me standing there calling him. He then decides to do a Kenny and isn't coming in. He thinks, right, I'm going to stand here and eat some of this chicken. Defiant as ever is Kenny. He then eats a bit more of the chicken before deciding he's not coming in. So I go outside to try and get him to come in and he runs round me to avoid me but then does come through the door. Samba then turns up again and starts to eat the chicken that is on the ground. If you look closely you will see Pip coming down the road. He then comes over to the garden to see what's going on. Pip then enters the garden and as he enters the garden that's the cue for Samba to leave. Pip grabbed one small piece of chicken and off he goes to return again a few seconds later. Off he goes again and he's soon back. And off he goes to come back again. So Pip is the only fox that we've actually seen tonight or have actually seen on the camera. Um, we've seen the cats, Samba, Ninja Cat, Kenny and Norman. But I am putting a lot of this down to mating season. It has been a while since we've seen Basil. That's now been nine days. It's been 15 days or nights since we last saw Cookie. And it's been nearly five weeks since Jimmy was last here. I do miss all of them and I'd like to just see all of them just to make sure they're all okay. That's all I ask.
but like I say because of mating season this does happen it's just not happened for so long um, both Basil and Cookie have been back and forth more regularly during mating season last year but this year they've been gone for a lot longer which is kind of worrying but fingers crossed they are all well and safe and a big thanks to my son Matt for helping me edit these videos adding the music because that's the bit I really can't do but he does all the daytime videos he edits them takes out the boring part speeds things up like when I go shopping um, and like I say he adds all the music because I haven't got a clue how to do that so thank you very much Matt I love you loads